Watersheds are where fish swim and bugs crawl and birds come to drink and eat. And they're just amazing places to introduce kids to the natural world. Connecting youth to the environment is critical to all of us. We want to engage kids in science and technology education. We want to connect them to their environment. We had over 1,600 children impacted, and we also had about 180 educators. And the wonderful thing about reaching an educator is that they continue to touch the lives of children over time. The Department of Education has funded the 21st Century Community Learning Center. They came to NOAA because they thought that NOAA could help inspire kids about science and get them more interested in learning and better able to perform in school. We reach out to the National Marine Sanctuary Foundation. The National Marine Sanctuary Foundation is all about building partnerships. So the role that we played in this was to help bring partners together. That was the federal government working with local communities and working with people in their watersheds in order to provide this program. National Marine Sanctuary Foundation reached out to our BWET grantees and partners and to 21st Century Community Learning Centers and had them create partnerships which we supported with Department of Education funds. And so we brought together the expertise of the BWET educators and the local expertise of the 21st Century Community Learning Center educators and together they were able to create the opportunity to get the kids out of the classroom, outside, learning about their environment and, and really feeling better connected to the place they live. The benefit of a program like this is kids get to get out and explore nature. It's a way to kind of unlock kids' passion for learning in a way that's not just trying to be in a book. It's actually taking the book and bringing it alive in the community. Because sometimes when you feel passionate about an issue, you can kind of come out of your shell. So I think with some students what it's done is they felt so passionate about protecting their watersheds or protecting their ocean that they actually have now become advocates, that they've become community leaders on these issues. I'm very hopeful that this program will help create ocean leaders. I think when you can bring the federal government, working with nonprofits, working with subject matter experts in the, in the area, it's just a much more enriching experience for our children. So I hope that this is a, this is a model that we can actually replicate and continue to do in the future.